All right. So, um, and then for the final one, uh, we've got a 12 centimeter diameter loop. It's got 58 windings. It's pulled from the field in a certain amount of time, right? Let's figure out the direction of the current. <laughs> um, in the next picture, it's going to be like this. It'll be out of the page. <coughs> Sorry, out of the um, magnetic field. So we are losing. We are losing flux into the page, right? So we would replace the flux, right? And to, the way to replace flux into the page is to go clockwise, okay? Because if you go clockwise, you create flux into the page, okay? So the answer is clockwise, right? Um, you can also do this another way if you draw a picture of it as it's leaving. Because, of course, while it's in the magnetic field entirely, no EMF induced. When it's out of it entirely, there's no EMF induced. In fact, it's only induced while it's being pulled out. And, in fact, it's not a constant EMF, right? It's an average sort of EMF, right? Um, so what is the average EMF, right? As it's being pulled out, if you just simply may pretend like you're a positive charge on this wire and go index finger this way, middle finger into the page, right? Okay. Well, that would mean that you're being forced um, up this, up this way, right? Well, which in general would make you go clockwise in that loop. So that's another way to do it. Uh, let's solve for the, um, for the uh, EMF. So EMF is going to be NBA over T. And there's a minus sign that I generally ignore. So uh, what do we have here? I guess we're just solving for EMF. So that's going to be 58 windings. Our magnetic field is 3.1 Teslas. Our area is pi times, let's see, it's 12 centimeters diameter. So it's 0 0.12 meters in diameter divided by 2 is 0 0.06 meters. That's our radius, right? So pi r squared, 0 0.06 squared and then we can divide by uh, 0 0.015 all right let's calculate this all right 58 brian tyner i don't know where you are but you've changed my life forever uh, 58 times 3.1 times pi times 0 0.06 i should look him up on facebook all right squared divided by 0 0.015 i'm getting 135.566 Da, yay! Go team. Hope that helps.